I have just arrived at one of my favorite honey holes. I come here once a year. I'm not telling. If you figure it out, you figure it out. But in the meantime, let's go in. I have just under two hours to shop, which is not nearly enough time for this place. This is one of the only places where I opt for a cart, if that tells you something. Wow, this horse is amazing. Really pretty compote. Hey, look, it's one of those I dream a genie jars. How fun. The monkey. How great. 33. That's so great. I like the vibe in this booth. Oh my gosh, look at this dress. The lining is amazing. And some crazy baby dolls. <laughs> Ooh, the tiger. No, it's priceless. Dang. This is a really pretty plate. Limoges. Wow, look at this. Yellow face pottery. And then look at these fish. These are crazy too. Diane Artware Kissy Fish. Very cool. Even though they're contemporary, I'm into that. What's going on over here? I remember that face. Handmade pottery, $5. That's cool. That's a nice hobbyist piece. All right, a little jadeite, $20. And uh, slag, eight bucks, acro agate. I'll take that, that's really pretty. And then, how much on this one? Eight. More, more into that style. Whoa. Germany. Wow, those are amazing, $99 each. More monkey decor. I will say that other monkey was a good buy, but eh, I'm just in a particular mood. You know how I get. Wow, look at this wall art. That's different. Metal wall art, flower and vase, 25 bucks. Oh my gosh, the laundry sprinkler. It's probably spendy, they usually are. Yeah, $40 firm. That's for a collector. What's this jacket? The Indians, oh my gosh. A little busier than I'd hoped for. Whoa. Look at this bird. As is. Wow. That's amazing. These are really cool too, these glasses. Huh. Like that set. Yeah, that bird is something else. I don't really wanna mess with it though. It's repaired right here. Wow, look at this coin up machine. That is amazing. Whoa, look at all the crazy. <gasps> $700, but look at the eyeball one. Wow. Oh my gosh. These guys are only 38, but it's kind of hard. It's kind of hard to unsee that. Look at these ones. So cool. I know how to do it now. Oh my gosh. I don't see one I have to have other than the one that's $700, which checks out for me. See, I like stuff like this. Carnival knockdown, 75 bucks. Yeah, those are usually expensive. Good grief. Look at that. Piano lamp, $295. That is insane. Absolutely insane. All right, I need to walk away from that. <laughs> That's epic. Good grief. That's wild. Cracked, though. Um, the Fenton is what I was going for. I love that emerald green. Or Kelly green. <gasps> no. Is this what I think it is? That's mid-century pottery. $38. 
It's kind of a steal. I feel like I should get that. Came all the way here, can't leave it now. Look at the camel, how funny is that? Oh, I'm having second thoughts. I wish I could remember who this is. I feel like that's good. I'm just gonna let it go. I've had worse things happen to me than being stuck with a piece of epic mid-century cat pottery. Although I have a feeling it's something good. Look at the pin cushions. Priceless. Wow, look at this artist felted. Chicks, those are fantastic. They're felted. <gasps> I love them. All the cats. <laughs> Let's see. 25, yeah. What about the planter? 18, not bad. Oh my gosh, look at this guy. So fun. 14, Japan. He's pretty great. I feel like I'd do well on that. I'm gonna go ahead and pick him up as well. And then back over here. This guy's kind of depressing. What's happening here? It's really unusual. And more cats. 35. Shafford, that's it. Shafford. Oh my gosh, yes, that's gotta be it. Right? That's Shafford, right? No. That's got an F in it. Chantal. It's like on the tip of my tongue. That's gonna drive me nuts the entire time I'm here. Wow, this is really pretty. Wow, interesting seal. Very cool. Giant Italian cat. No, Japan, interesting. Looks Italian, I was gonna say. Oh, cool. Look at this hand-painted cat plate. 98 though, 24. I don't think I can do much with that. For hot foot. Oh my gosh, so good. At 35 though, that doesn't leave enough room for me. I would only be able to get that for myself. And it's not my favorite one. I have a bunch of things like that. I do have a small collection of the Japan, Japan Risqué, but God, that jewel casket's gorgeous, 48. Another unusual, it looks like Fit, yep, Fitz and Floyd. Oh, they're nesting, those are so neat. What a fabulous little uh, ashtray. $15, 1976, enamel over copper. Oh, that's really pretty. It's signed, which makes me wanna go for it. It's a little bit more than I'd like to pay. Um, I think I would do all right with it. Oh my gosh, like what? What an epic sign. Oh, I'm just a little hesitant. It's like, if it was like 10, I'd do it without hesitation. What are these glasses? Mid-century cat glasses, $30, sold. No questions asked on that one for the set of four. Wow, they're like so MCM. I don't usually do glasses just because I used to and um, sometimes they do pretty well but it just takes a lot of stuff to ship them and also what's this weird monkey book in? Fitz and Floyd $34 that's so good speaking of bookends here's something I've never seen before how much are you you're gonna make me work for it $24 wow those are great the anthropomorphic bugs definitely could make a couple bucks off of them. I don't know how much. I mean, I feel like the bug figurines alone sell for 24 bucks. I don't know. It's a little more than I'd like to have invested right now. I'm like obsessed with what, what's happening in this cart. Whoa. That's wild. I like what's happening back here. Although it's kind of hard to get around with the cases when you don't have phone service to call somebody. This place is huge. Oh my gosh. That color combo. Oh, the jack in the pulpit. Oh my gosh. I think, wait a minute. How much is that? Of course it's in a case. And of course you can't see. Oh my gosh. Well, that one says $38. 
So, I think I'm just gonna have to risk it and get in here, right? Let's see, I can see. All right, so that one's 60. How much is that? 125. Well, that one I would take at $38. Why is it $38? It's really epic. In case you're a blow mold person, check this out. Right? And hold Howard six piece with the pitcher 325. Eggnog set. That's really epic. super hard to find. It looks like it's in great condition too. This is so an overwhelming. Oh my God, inflatable Santa. I love those. I have one. It's just deflated. Whoa. Large MCM Siamese cats. That's wicked. <laughs> Look at this unusual stone zebra. That's really interesting. Ooh, look at this. Is this black? I feel like it's purple, but it looks kind of black. Nope, it's black. Brown. No, it's kind of purple. I've had that one before. Just kidding. It's exactly what I thought it was. This booth is beautiful. I love the World's Fair pose doll. Little spendy. Oh my gosh, look at this crazy clock. <laughs> That's wild. I've never seen that exact one before. Oh my gosh, but this monkey, he needs help. $52. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Those are usually spendy. She's cute. $16. I love the pose doll and the uh, wall art. Oh my gosh, I just entered the next room and it's wild in here. So pretty. I love the Victorian glass. A little Fire King polka dot moment happening over here. Oh my gosh, look at the celluloid doll. That's only 29 95 firm. Oh my gosh. $349, okay. <laughs> I was like getting ready to like rip that thing off the wall, but not for $349, although it's worth it. That thing is so great. Oh, and it gives such good light too. Epic Bambi planter. Whew, I need to take a breath. This is gonna be my last stop of the day. Um, I've definitely seen a lot of stuff. This is so cool, this mug set. I love those, $6 each. Now we're talking. Check her out, $36. And <laughs> she's got the surprise underneath. That's a little close for me. Plus I just had one sold for like 40 something. Oh my gosh, the reindeer. <gasps> 149, yeah, that's on brand. And the Holt Howard Cozy Kitties, 55 again. Um, that set I see all the time for like crazy, crazy prices. I feel like 55 is what I usually get out of them. Very noteworthy is the mantle clock though. Marie Antoinette style clock 425 that is gorgeous and for peace of mind i gotta check out the price tag on the noon the nude so great the first time i came here i actually found one of the most epic things i've ever found in this booth it was a pair of napco astronaut planters so good super great cat salt and pepper shakers 19 dollars for the pair not bad for a collector. Wow, the nesting dolls. Oh my gosh. Those are like the real deal. Look at the Snow White one. Very, very cool. All right, bangles, red and white, $18 though. How much is the jar? I'm assuming it's expensive. <laughs> you have to open the whole top. <laughs> $12, no, that's not bad actually, thought it would be more. Um, this chain is really fun. That's vintage, 18. You can tell from uh, the feel of it, or at least I can, I should say. I love the half doll. And that uh, perfume bottle, it's probably French. Oh my gosh, look at the celluloid uh, 
Can Can doll. She is definitely French. This dresser set has my attention. 25 what kind of markings do we have on this? Japan. It's really awesome. Oh, I kind of want to pick it up. It just like requires so much packing material. This giraffe though. Costa Boda question mark $30. Dang, that thing's so cool. Ooh. The good stuff. <laughs> wow. Looks bendy. For sure. Good grief. Look at that. $175. Oh, I love the chessy jar. That's at $195. Yeah, the vent in here is amazing. Definitely on a little on the spendy side. Although <laughs> I can't talk. I just bought myself a very spendy fen uh, Fenton cat. Look at this. This has a certain look to it, doesn't it? Interesting. Wonder if it has it, what it is on the description. Unusual rare face picture, no clue. I love it. <laughs> Oh, this is such a fun set. I had it once, uh, it's by Napco Wear. Yeah, it didn't sell that well. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave it for that price. Good grief, that's a giant perfume bottle. Wow. Like, huge perfume bottle. It's not as heavy as I thought it was gonna be either. Crystal. What's going on with the uh, cucumber people? 29. I love those anthropomorphic vegetables. Look at this with the satin finish. $20. Sign. Ooh. Interesting. TWOS Company. Not what I thought it was. It looked like Fenton. Look at this funny thing. <laughs> Folk art. Wow, that's heavy. LW. That's really quite spectacular, though. $15. Hmm. Not sure about that. I don't know how well it would do. It's pretty great, but I have no idea what it is other than funny. <laughs> like the uh, white opalescent dugan. Wow, that's a really interesting owl paperweight. Whoa, what's going on with that jack in the pulpit? $60. Interesting. Polished bottom. That wasn't expecting that. A little, a little unsure. It's really pretty though. It's like a really interesting color. Something just like makes me concerned it's Chinese. I don't know enough about it to invest 60 bucks in it for resale. Well, that's all she wrote for today. Uh, got out easy in there. I only spent $90. Now I have no idea where my next destination is. I'm going to get in the car, look at a map, and uh, figure out where I'm headed. <laughs> it's kind of part of the fun. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.